Hammer, Hammer. A little bit of a messy gap, we're gonna tidy up. Hello. That's it, good girls. Yeah, man. Few stragglers to the end here. Good girl. <laughs> good girls. Last one. Very happy girls to see some fresh grass. They on bales for the last couple of weeks. So we allow the grass to grow a bit and also get some fencing done. They're all settling in nicely. This area was grazed in January. Grown pretty well considering the weather. So we work our way up. up the rest of the field and hopefully in time we shall be lambing the starting about a week. So as you can see most of the numbers are in black but the full can I had ran out so I went to orange. So the last last couple are are orange. Good to get back grazing again after the after break. Hello. How are you? Are you good? This is the bit that got a little bit poached, which I wasn't happy about, but it's recovered very well. The only real bit you can see about it is where one of the mineral licks was. And it's filling in pretty quickly. So pretty happy about that. That's one way to get the wool off. Scratch against the mini truck. Thanks. <laughs> All right, so lambing 2024 has begun. This ewe is about to lamb a couple of days early. We are on what are we, the 15th of March. Uh, she's not due till the 18th, but yeah, a couple of days her waters have just broken. So hopefully we'll have, have some lambs soon enough. Oh, I'm really happy. Always great to see the first ones coming out. Totally unassisted. Both of them have been up and sucking at the room, which is great. I'm delighted now. Um, it always helps when you have a good start. So I'll just keep an eye on them and let them bond up for now. But yeah, really happy. So I've just come out to check on the sheep. Um, he knew that lamb today. Looking after her little lambs, the fence, all good. And I'll get the rest of them up. So hopefully if there's any ones that are looking to lamb tonight, they'll hold off to the morning. 